imagine you are exploring in the nether fortress deep below your base. As you progress further and further into the dungeon, you start to hear some strange breathing. You turn the corner, expecting to see a blaze, but you run into this thing. This guy is called the Wildfire. The Wildfire, also known as the Hovering Inferno, was a contender in the 2017 mob vote, along with the Barnacle, the Great Hunger, and the winning Phantom. The Wildfire is a type of blaze. This blaze type of mob has the same design as the regular blaze, although this specific mob has rectangular shields that spin around it. It uses these shields to defend itself from certain attacks. If it was introduced into the main game back in 2017, it is believed that wildfires would have also had the ability to cause a flaming shockwave. Sadly, this mob was eliminated after the second poll back in 2017. But nevertheless, this flaming hot mob will officially be making its Minecraft debut in Minecraft Dungeons, along with the release of Season 2 Luminous Night update on April 20th. The mob possesses four large shields which float around it, which act as protection, and a fifth one shaped as a pillar under its head. Its head is that of a normal blaze with the exception of it wearing a helmet, fitted with a small red gem. I really like the design of this mob. I always thought that the blaze was a great looking mob, but I really think they hit it out of the park with this design. If you didn't know, this mob was originally planned to be released in the Flames of the Nether DLC but was cut due to time constraints. However, some Minecraft Dungeoneers noticed that there is actually a statue of this mob in the Nether Fortress mission. They asked about this statue to the game's dev team and the game developer Mark Watson responded. He basically said that wildfires were actually supposed to be another event mob, like the Ghast or Enderman, but that mob wasn't ready to be released as they were still working through some behaviors, balancing, testing, etc. Well, it looks like they got their stuff together and finally got around to polishing this mob off and we're expecting it to be in the Season 2 Tower release. In fact, since he said that this was supposed to be an event mob, I expect it to be an entire boss fight in the tower. Either way, I'm really excited that the dev team is giving this game some much needed love and attention. A lot of people are frustrated with the state of the game, myself included, and hopefully this update will be a step in the right direction. Who knows? Maybe this will bring some more people back to the game. One can only hope. What do you think about the new wildfire mob coming to the game? Are you excited about the new tower update? Let me know in the comment section below. And hit that like button if you enjoyed this video and would like to see more like it. I will be making more videos as more details are announced, so be sure to subscribe to the channel if you want to stay up to date on all the details and announcements. Well, that's all I have for today's video. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next video.